a convicted drug dealer went before the chairman of the state parole board today in hopes of regaining his freedom. Richard Wershey, known as White Boy Rick, has been behind bars for nearly 30 years for selling drugs as a teenager. As Kevin Dietz reports, Wershey is hoping today's hearing will help him get one step closer to freedom. For 45 minutes inside Oaks Correctional Facility, Rick Wershey answered questions from the chairman of the Michigan Parole Board. The way that Rick handled himself, he was very calm. He answered the questions appropriately, factually. Um, and I just thought it was a good interview. It was very positive. Where she explained the devastation drugs create and apologized for selling cocaine as a 16 and 17 year old teenager in Detroit. He wanted to know about the invo Rick's involvement in the drug trade, how long he was involved, how much money he made off of it, how he was arrested, the facts and circumstances surrounding that. And where she promised if released, he would not go back to a life of crime, explaining that he has job offers and a place to live once out. He's got a good support system on the outside. Um, he's got job offers. He has offers of housing. So that's not going to be a problem. Where she hopes his answers will lead to a public hearing in front of the full parole board and ultimately his release from prison, where he's been behind bars for over 29 years. Now he's doing well. He's doing as, as well as anybody can, having spent almost 30 years of his life in prison. And that was Kevin Dietz reporting. Where she will have to wait about three to four weeks to find out if he's going to get that public hearing or not. If he does, that's when it will be decided if he'll be released or not. We will be tracking this story for you.